Hi there, I'm Logan Queen with the Jennifer Queen Real Estate Team and Remax Professionals. And today we are on the beautiful Hart Trail in the south of Charleswood to talk about how great of a community this is. Charleswood is an expansive neighborhood located in the southwest portion of Winnipeg and is bordered by the Assiniboine River to the north, McGillivray Boulevard to the south, the Perimeter Highway to the west, and the Assiniboine Forest or Shaftesbury Boulevard to the east. Charleswood is located approximately 15 kilometers from downtown Winnipeg and approximately 12 kilometers from the James Richardson Airport. Along the main thoroughfares of Roblin Boulevard and Grant Avenue, you will find commercial real estate, and along Wilkes Avenue, you will find a mix of commercial and industrial land with some parks and recreational space in between. Most of Charleswood is residential land use. However, there is a large amount of land in South Charleswood that still remains undeveloped. Here in Charleswood, you have an area that is made up of homes that were built Primarily in the 60s, 70s, 80s, um, lots of homes that have been around for a long time. Um, the whole area is made up of a lot of bungalows, um, two stories, a bit of bi-levels and a mix of everything in between. Um, there is a newer neighborhood called Ridgewood West, which is on the south side of the community. Um, and most of those homes are, have been built uh, since about uh, the 2010s or so. In Charleswood, you can find a complete mix of property types. You're going to find family-friendly, affordable homes, and then you can also find things that are luxury properties that are on the north side of the community, near the Assiniboine River and on the river. Charleswood is a semi-rural residential neighborhood, and what that means is the lots are actually quite large. Um, a typical city lot is about 20 to 25 by 100 feet, and usually what you're getting here in Charleswood is about 35 to 50 on the front, and about 100 to 125 or more, up to about 250 on the back. So you have almost your own park in your backyard. There are nearly 10,000 homes in the Charleswood area, and this includes close to 20 parks. A few of the major ones are the Hart Trail, the Assiniboine Forest, and the Charleswood Off-Leash Dog Park. The area is sought after for its large park-like lots, green spaces, and a rural feel within the city of Winnipeg. Charleswood is a multi-generational area with a large proportion of young families and an equal proportion of empty nesters. Approximately 82% of homes in the area are owner-occupied and have an annual average income above $100,000. Charleswood is located within the Pembina Trails School Division. However, with the large size of the neighborhood, the school that your child will attend is determined by your location within a school catchment in the neighborhood. There are 11 schools to support the area and this includes six elementary schools with a Cole Dieppe being a French immersion option. There are also three middle schools including a French immersion option at Ecole Charleswood and two high schools, Shaftesbury which is an all English school and Oak Park which offers English and French immersion options. Additionally, Charleswood is home to one post-secondary school which is the Canadian Mennonite University. There is no hospital in Charleswood, but the closest hospital is the Grace Hospital and is located off Portage Avenue, a short drive north on the William R. Clement Parkway and the Moray Bridge. Shopping in Charleswood proper has a focus on mom and pop shops and strip malls located along Grant Avenue and Roblin Boulevard. Major shopping centres are located in close proximity at Keniston Crossing, 
Keniston Common, Polo Park Shopping Center, and especially at the Seasons of Tuxedo, which hosts large retailers like IKEA, Cabela's, and the Outlet Collection of Winnipeg. Charleswood has a plethora of options for outdoor and indoor entertainment areas. If you are looking for outdoor activities, you can visit the Assiniboine Forest, the Hart Trail, and Fort White Alive. There are also multiple community centers with outdoor hockey rinks and fields for baseball and soccer. Some of these include Eric Coy Arena, Charleswood Place, Varsity View Sportsplex, and Pacific Junction Park. So one of the reasons I absolutely love Charleswood is it has a great sense of community. Uh, you really do get to know your neighbors. It's a very close-knit, tight-feeling community. It feels just like a small town within the city. Um, people who grow up here, tend to move back here, they buy their own houses here and you do see lots of family turnover and staying in the area. So there is a, a great sense of community and a great small tight-knit area to live in. Uh, we like living here because of uh, the nice, uh, nice forests and parks around the area. Um, the Cinnaboyne Forest here is really nice to take your family for a nice walk during the weekend or during the week. Yeah. Uh, the parks over around the forest over here are awesome for the kids. They got nice play structures around this area and uh, it's just beautiful this time of year in, in the forest and the playgrounds. I love the Assiniboine Forest. Uh, that it would be my favorite place. I walk here almost every day. Oh, I like Charleswood here because we're so close to the forest. It's very quiet and peaceful. Everyone's very open and welcome, everyone's so nice. And you're so close to nature more or less in your backyard. It's like living in a forest. Wow. Yeah, you love those leaves, hey? You like the trails too, Emma? Uh, yeah. yeah. I like the trails. We like to run and walk. Summary, we like the trails. Yeah, <laughs> we, you know what, we love the area. We've been here just a few years and it's so wonderful that we basically have the forest in our backyards and uh, we couldn't ask for anything more. That's why we're still here. Grasshoppers and frogs. You love grasshoppers and frogs. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks for coming along on this neighborhood tour with us today. We hope you enjoyed what you saw. If you did, please hit that like button and if you would like to see more, please subscribe to our channel.